ready? Okay. Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the Chester High School and the Fred Pickett Jr. Gymnasium, a.k.a. the Clip Joint. We have girls varsity basketball here, and we have the Rockets from Alden Reed High from the Philadelphia Public League taking on your Chester Lady Clippers. And this is the very first game for the Lady Clippers this year. And they come under, under the direction of new and former head coach Marvin Boo Dukes. Alden Reed from the Philadelphia Public League. I'm still waiting on a roster and to give me some more information from them. We have 34 seconds before we tip off. Hope you enjoy the contest here on cmpradio.net. I am James Peach Howard today doing the commentating for you. Hope you enjoy. And we're going to see some fine holiday basketball here from the clip joint. Where Bell at? Right now we're under a little delay here. Cause we're gonna go here, we, so we're gonna have the national anthem. We're not, so we're just gonna go what we have. Right now, Alden Reed with the blue uniforms, royal blue trimmed with yellow numbers, white trim. Chest Lady Clippers in the smoke uniforms, orange numbers, trimmed in orange and black. And we have the tip. All right now, we have number four for the Lady Clippers. Let me both both gives it back to number two, Hall. As Chester's going to look like running the motion offense here early. All the looks like in a 1-3-1 one, one zone and fires up number four. Rebound for the Lady Clippers. And the ball will stay just in down here. Clipper Lady st starters here for the Clippers or the sophomore number two, Shine Hall. Also number four, sophomore, Tanaja Bose. Senior, number 32, Rochelle Kelly. Number 35, freshman. Sinatra Henley. And like an early foul on Lady Clippers number four, Tanaja Bose. That'll be her first and the team's first. The other starter for the Lady Clippers is number 20, freshman Janaya Muhammad. At the line for Alden Reed will be number 30, can't touch you the ponytail, covering her number. She misses the first. Uh, they just have first names on their books. So I'm going to say her name is Cheyenne. That's shooting at the line. And she misses both rebound number 32. Oh, Kelly. Again, Lady Clippers run the motion offense. We swing to the left wing to number 20. Rebound Alden Reed. We have a jump ball. And possession will go to Alden Reed. So the Lady Clippers will get the next dead ball. And number one brings up for the Rockets, just crossing the timeline. Chester in a 2-3 zone. Number 30, Cheyenne, whips it back to number 10. Again, I'll get names a little later. Number 32, swing. Oh, baseline and layup, no good. Rebound to the Lady Clippers, off to number four, Tanaja Bose. And number 32 without a bounds. We'll check that, we'll take it out on the side. Tanaja Bose will take it out for the Lady Clippers. We have an early sub, number three coming in for Alden Reed. That'll be Maya Brax Young. Back to Bose. She takes the shot. Off. Gets her own rebound. Goes to the basket, and she scores! First basket of the year for Lady Clippers. Tanaja Bose, Lady Clippers lead 2-0. Now the definitely a nice power move, fighting for her own rebound. 
Number 32 takes a three from the wing, and she hits. So a three from the corner from Alden Reed. They're now up three to two. Bosa is bringing the ball down for the Lady Clippers as she just crosses the timeline, comes to the right wing, driving to the basket. Oh, and a scoop to the loose shot layup. And Bosa has four early points for the Lady Clippers. Alden Reed comes across the timeline, pass baseline, number 30, and she scores on the layup. So right now, some good early offense here in the first quarter. 5.54 remaining. Alton Reed is up 5-4. So now you're supposed to give the ball in her hand. Right now, it seems like all the offense goes through her. She passes to number 20, Muhammad. Up and a steal for Alden Reed's number one. She scores up the layup. And we have an early three-point lead for the Lady Rockets of Alden Reed. Boo Dukes just called a play. Again, Bose brings it across the timeline. Looked like Alden Reed's changed his zone a little bit. A three from the corner. Good shot by number two. Hall. Oh, and they count the goal. Wow. That might have been an NBA uh, follow through foul right there. And that foul is on number. They called it on number three, but number three is not out there. That would be number two. That foul is probably on Hall. That would be her first team, second. And Lady Clippers coming to substitution number 10. Talaja Smith. All the reads at the line. And that was number three for Alden Reed. She completes the three-point play. Alden Reed leads 10 to four. Again, Bose brings it back across the timeline. Looks like Alden Reed right now went to a 3-2 zone. Bose gets caught in there. Number 10, the ball. Smith, Bose gets the ball back. It was tipped. So no, no backcourt. Ah, uh, number 30's riding. And that'll be her first foul. Teams first. And all the reading I guess is sub, number five comes in. Like I said, I'll get names later. I get into the first game, so roster's a little shaky. Teams are just getting their uniforms. Oh, a little physical play there. Ball by number 20, Jemiah Muhammad gets it. She's double teamed. And the ball stays with the Lady Clippers. And Marvin Dukes is trying to get the rest uh, Looks like Chester's calls a 30-second timeout. So we have a 30-second timeout here at the clip joint. Alden Reed leads 10 to 4. And again, this is the Lady Clippers' first game of the year under a new coach. So some new schemes have been put in. I do like the new uniform that Chester's wearing, the smoke gray. And again, we have Chester with a couple of freshmen that, that are on the court. So they're young. And again, you're watching Lady Chester Lady Clippers basketball here on cmpradio.net. Say timeout's over. And let's see what Chester comes out in. Like I said, they've been trying to run the motion offense to begin this first period. All the read looks like they, okay, they went back into, okay, they like they're playing a little zone again with man principles. Off to the corner to number 10, she shoots. Rebound Lady Clippers. And it's with both, both swings to number two, Hall. She misses. And off the hands of number 20 for Lady Clippers, Muhammad. That'll go up to Alden Reed. One thing I will say about the Lady Clippers, they're not afraid to go to the basket and shoot. So kind of like that aggressive attitude with them. Number 10 for Alden Reed on the left wing. She shoots, miss. Both with the rebound and she dribbles up. Again, she calls out the play, motion offense. Let's see how many, number 10 goes to the bat. Oh, nice steal. But she was out of bounds. That was number 32 for Alden Reed. Jemiah Muhammad would take it off for the Lady Clippers. She swings to number 10. Smith, Smith with the shot. Rebound. And again, number three for Alden Reed. 
Oh, good defense back for Bosa. She hustles back. That'll be a foul on her. I think that's her second team's third. Again, number three at the line for reach. She's shooting two shots. She makes the first. I know the scoreboard has three fouls to zero, but that should read three fouls to one. Audrey does have one foul. And she shoots the second, and it's good. She makes both. So Audrey with a quick eight-point lead here, 12-4, here in the first period. Again, both bring the ball down. And number 32 picks up the foul. Sub in for the Lady Clippers. That's number five. That'll be Sky Fryson. She replaces Bose. Sky is one of the few Clippers who played last year in the shortened season. Whoa, slide on the floor, no traveling call. Number 32 goes up. She misses a point blank bunny layup. And Chester over the attack as they drive down. Number two, Hall. And a block on Alderby. And Alderby sort of picked the fouls up. Foul was on number two for Alderby. That's their third team foul. They get a sub coming in for them. Number 12. Muhammad takes the ball for the Lady Clippers on the baseline. Shot by number five. Oh, and a good shot, but a miss there by Fryson. Rebound by Alden Reed, and they're attacking on the break. And number 32 scores, and they play up the Golden State Warrior colors, and they run the break like the Warriors right now. 14-4, to four, Alden Reed. Oh, bad pass there. A steal and lamp by number three, and Chester's going to call another timeout. That'll be a full timeout by the Lady Clippers. And they trail 16 to 4. And again, you're watching this game on cmpradio.net. We're back here in the clip joint, 2.56 remaining in the first quarter. Chester brings the ball down. Now be Muhammad bringing it down. She goes across the timeline, just gets it over. She's going in the left corner, driving to the basket. Oh, nice pass. Back to Muhammad. At the hall, try to save it. Out of bounds. They had a good idea to try to break that zone. And Alder Reed now brings the ball down, number three. Again, hopefully at the end of the quarter, or maybe at least by halftime, I can get a roster from Alden Reed. So I can say the young ladies' names. Right now, Chester's right now in a two, three zone. And they're trying to pack it in. Looks like they're willing to give up the three. They now come out. Nice swing. Oh. And with the Chester defense staying packed tight, they force a turnover. Ball over to the Lady Clippers. Shemaya Muhammad would take it out. Now she gets the ball back. She comes on the left side. Again, all the reinforcements is another trap. And what Chester's going to have to probably do is to keep the ball in the middle. When they're going to the sides, they're getting trapped by an aggressive Alden Reed defense. This 2-3 zone they're playing. 
But like they're playing the zone with man principles. Number 35 for the Lady Clippers is Handley. She looks, passes out, three-point attempt. Nice shot there by Hall. Just the Lady Clippers get back, and all the reads on the attack. All reads passes down to the box, the number five. She shoots, miss. Ball stays here with Alden Reed. That ball was off number 10 for the Lady Clippers. To Leah Smith. Again, back to number five. Who seems to get a lot of position down there. Swings it back up to number 32. Takes a shot of three-point attempt. She misses. Rebound again by number 12 for Alden Reed. She shoots. She misses. Again, Alden Reed is clearing the boards here. And they're just getting the rebounds here. Number three seems to be the point guard here for Alden Reed. She works around, comes down, the drives the lane. Nice pass, number five. And she scores. Foul on the Lady Clippers. And the sub comes in for Chester. That'll be number 32. Returning in. That's Bashara Kelly. Returns to the lineup. Number five shooting for Alden Reed. And she'll be shooting one. And she misses. On a rebound for the Lady Clippers, number 20, Muhammad. And she brings it down. She comes down the left side. Whoa, almost over and back call, but she got it through. So Hall, Hall was stolen from her. Number 32 for Alden Reed. She steals in the layup. And she misses. Kelly with the rebound for the Lady Clippers. It'd be a time to jump ball. That should go to Chester. And yeah, rest was confused, but that was Chester's ball. Chester substitution. Shiana Snowden comes in. Now running the point for Chester is Sky Fryson. So let's see what they do here. She keeps the ball to the middle, swings to the left. Over to Hall. Hall comes over to the left side. Nice pass to number three for Lady Clipper. And they score. Snowden scores in the pass from Fryson. Now the important confident basket right there. Chester goes back into a 2-3 zone. Let's see if Alderry holds for the last shot of the quarter. We're at 27 seconds and counting. Number three dribbles up top. And they're looking. Chester now come out to extend their zone. Almost a steal there, but number three gets it back for Alden Reed. She drives to the middle, looks, takes it to the wing. Number one drives baseline, and she scores. Pricing come down with Chester. I don't know if Price is looking at the clock, but it's four seconds. She comes down, she goes to the hall, shoots, and she hits a three at the buzzer. Shine Hall, big basket there. And we're at the end of one period here from the clip joint. Alden Reed leads 20 to 9, and you're watching Chess Lady Clippers basketball on CMPRadio.net. Yeah, we're back here in the clip joint, second quarter. Girls varsity basketball. Alden Reed leads 20 to 9. It'll be their ball. Number one takes it out to number three. Again, I apologize for not having a roster for Alden Reed. Hopefully, I'll get some by halftime. 
Three-point attempt there by number number 10 for Alden Reed. And right now, Alden Reed's hot from that three-point line. Chester drives down, up. That'll be a kickball on Alden Reed. As Shine Hall was trying to go through the middle, it'd be Lady Clippers' ball. Kelly would take it out for the Lady Clippers. And she passes it to Sky, Pricing. Up, a steal there by number one for Alden Reed. Still on a layup. And again, some of the nervous early season jitters for the Lady Clippers. I, as I stated earlier, this is their very first game of the year. Still there by Alden Reed again with number one. That's two in a row for her. But she misses the layup. Chester gets back on D. Number 10, not afraid to shoot for Alden Reed. Hits the front of the iron. Pricing with the rebound. Pricing down to Snowden. Shea takes a shot. Not a bad shot. They got to follow up, though. And substitution for the Lady Clippers. Tanaja Bolts returns to the lineup. Replacing Friday. Pricing, excuse me. Aubrey comes down again, number three. Chester in the 2-3 zone. Let's see if they extend it here to stop the three-point shooting from Alden Reed. Oh, pace inside again, number five, who's been living down there in the paint. It seems like she's always open. Up, over, and back. And now the turnover. Ball goes to the Lady Clippers. We have 6.39 remaining in the first half. Again, Tanaja Bilks with the ball for the Lady Clippers. She looks, throws inside, but she traveled. Good look, good idea to give it to Kelly. But she moved that pivot. So another unforced turnover there. Alden Reed with the ball. And again, ball in the hands of number three for the Lady Rockets. Both come down that best three-point shooter. And with an active defense now for the Lady Clippers, they forced two turnovers in a row. Both with the ball, and she comes down the middle. Looks like now, all the reason the one, two, two. Both, nice move. See what that foul was on. Foul number two. That'd be the team fourth. It's not your boss at the line for the Lady Clippers. She has two shots. She misses the first. Alden Ray will come in with two substitutions, number 30 and number 32. And remember, number 32 was a starter, so she returns to the lineup. As with number 30, who both started earlier this game. Both has one more shot. Claim the rebound for the Lady Clippers. Good save. Number three for the Lady Clippers. Shoots, she misses. And Alden Reed on the attack. And on the break, and another turnover. So that's three straight turnovers for Alden Reed. And number three seems to love to push the tempo. So the Chester Lady Clippers have to find some way to get the ball out of her hands. Let the Clippers take it out, and again, bring it to Bose. Bose comes down. Smith is on the wing from her. Pass to, to Smith. Takes a shot. She misses. Rebound for the Lady Clippers. They hustle. It'll be a jump ball, and that'll go to Alden Reed. Oh, I'm sorry, no, it goes to Chester. If Alden Reed took the ball out to start the quarter. So Tanaja Bulls would take it out for Lady Clippers. Oh, she had an open person right there underneath the basket. And they go to Smith. Smith shoots. Good shot. Rebound, Lady Clippers. Good pass to Kelly. And she was fouled. Good pass from Snowden to Kelly. And that foul's on number 10 for Alden Reed. That is their 15 foul. So maybe Chester can get back in the game this way, going to the line. Rashard Kelly's at the line. She misses the first. Kelly, who's a senior. 
Then she has one shot. Up, oh, there's a violation. But one thing I say about these young lady Clippers, they are hustling. And from the looks of it, they seem to be in pretty good shape. When they come to the field, playing a 2 3 zone. Number three goes around. She passes to the corner. That's number three. He's out on the wing. Drafts back in the middle. Swings it back to the left side of number one. Left corner, number 32. And she shoots the three. And that seems to be their offense. Swing it. Get it to the corner. Shoot the three. That was number 32. So maybe at halftime, I'll get a point total also. That foul is probably on number one from Alder Reed as she fouled Shine Hall. So that's team foul number five, team foul number six. So next foul, Chester will be shooting. Lady Clippers take it out and they give it to Bose. Bose goes to the middle. She looks. She powers through. Oh, good shot of rebound, Kelly. And the follow-up, she misses. Both hustles. Great hustle. Oh, and good defense by number three for Lady Clippers, Snowden. And they force another turnover. Now, just to get some points in the basket, they are forcing turnovers. But right now, they're trailing by 19. And Bosa's coming down, dribbling up with her left hand, coming towards the left. Chester sets up. Right now, Alderby's with the steal, coming number 30. And she misses. Bosa's coming down the court. Uh, she didn't see. Now she sees number Ray Snowden. Back to Bosa. And Bosa's fouled. That foul on number 30 for Alder Reed. That's probably her second. I'll have to check. But definitely team seven for Chester's now in the bonus. But both is at the line for the Lady Clippers, and she'll be shooting two. Uh, she misses the first. No subs to come in. 425 remaining in the first half. Now both will go for the second. She misses both a rebound, number 10 for Lady Clippers. She misses. Tip from number 32 to Alder Reed. She's driving down the middle, driving. Steal by the Lady Clippers. Now it'll be Hall. And Hall went straight to the basket. Smart move to draw a foul. And that's on number 30 for Alden Reed. That's probably her third. Shine Hall to the line. She's a sophomore. And she's shooting two. She makes the first. She has one more. She makes them both. Good job, Shine Hall. It's now 28 to 11, Alden Reed. Number three comes back down. She was looking to take a shot, but she pulls it back out. Looks like they're going to run a little clock here. And she's working and looking. I think they're looking to get for that three-point. Ah, baseline, they found number 30, but she misses. Blocked. Snowden with the block for Lady Clippers. Ah, they're going to pick up a little cheap foul there. Shine Hall with that foul. And again, wholesale substitutions again for Alden Reed, number 12. And number two come in. Number 12 will take it out for Alden Reed, and she passes it to number three. Again, they're looking for that same play. They're looking to swing to the corners for a three, or looking for a baseline pass. Three takes it herself. Rebound number 32, and she is fouled. Number 32 is the line for Alden Reed. And she'll shoot two. 
Right now, I think she's there, probably their leading rebounder. And she misses the first. Okay, get her first name is Shea. I have to get her last name. She makes the second. So Shea makes one. Lady Clippers coming at it. Alden Reed stretches their zone. They swing from left wing. Number 10 for Lady Clippers with the shot. Oh, nice pass. And number three scores with assists for number 10. And Chester commits a violation. And Chester's going to have to relax here. Now the lead is stretched to 20. See, Alden Reed will take the ball out. Number three. Nice pass to 32. She missed the bunny. She goes up again, but she's fouled. And that seemed to be either the bread and butter. They swing around to the corners for the three. Alden Reed looks to drive and kick it down in the paint. They've been successful with both those plays. Number 32 is at the line again, shooting. And she missed it. She made one of two last time. This will be her second attempt. 3-14 remaining here in the first half. She makes the second. Kelly will take it out for the Lady Clippers, and we give it here again to Tanaja Bost. Bost runs the play, again, they call the motion offense. She tried to swing it, but it's getting a steal. Maula Reed, good D by Bost getting back, but she gets, number 10 gets the basket, and then she scores with an assist from number three. So those two have scored an assist on the last two made field goals for Alden Reed. Bost drives down the middle. Rebound all the read and again, the fast break. Number 10, all the read again goes up. She scores again, back to back baskets. And now Lady Clippers are now trailing by 25. So Sean's going to sit at the top of the wing. Both stay in the middle. Both is looking. Dribbles past two defenders. Pass it to the corner. Nice shot there, but number three for the Lady Clippers. Snowden. And again, all the read on the break. Number 10, again. Cherry picking and she scores again. Chester got to handle the ball a little better. So two minutes left in the first half. Again, Vos. And stolen again. And it'll be number 10 going for the layup. She misses. No three misses. She, she scores three for a quarter. Timeout, Lady Clippers. And that's like a 30 second timeout. 144 remain in the first half. It's 42 11. And right now, we're in danger of a running clock. For those of you who don't know in PIAA, if the team gets to 30, the running clock is then set in motion. for the second half. So hopefully the little Lady Clippers can fight this a little bit, work a play two here and get this deficit at least back down to 25. So let's see what Marvin, and, Marvin Dukes and company come out with this last 144 here of the first half. And will Alden Reed come out and again, Stretch their zone. They're playing a one, two, two. But the top person is coming way out top, forcing early. Or right now they've been instructed to pack it in, so maybe they're going to sit back a little bit. Okay, they're going to play a two, three. So them, again, they're probably playing a two, three to keep Chester from shooting threes. So already sitting in the 2-3. Chester still on the, on the wing, the number 10. Smith, Smith with the shot. No good. Number two gets it. 
Good stop there by both. And number 10 now will bring up Alden Reed. So Chester was successful stopping the break. 32 is on the, oh, they pass it number five. Returns, fires, misses. 32 with the rebound. She passes it back out. And good defense there for Chester's. To Leah Smith, she's a junior. Basket for number five from Alden Reed. So Chester did make them work for that basket. Okay, we got one minute left. Chester called out a play. And the Smith, Smith dribbles. Baseline, shoots, she misses. Rebound for Alden Reed. Steal again by Bose. Let's see if Chester attacks. She shoots for the top of the key. She misses. Rebound number 32. Oh, almost a steal there for Smith from Chester. Now let's see if Alden Reed holds for one shot. Number 12 right here on the left wing. She comes back. Chester comes out the channel. Number. She drives, looks, goes baseline, swings it around. Kick ball on Chester, 22.1 left. Number 32 out there on the wing. Number 10 gets it. They swing it back to number 12. But she's on the wing. 10's top of the key. She dribbles. She's looking. Good defense by Lady Clippers. Both steps up. They drive to the back. Ooh. Oh, and Chester stops him from shooting the basket. And that'll be the end of the first half. And it's Alden Reed Rockets, 42, Chester Lady Clippers, 11. And you're watching Girls Varsity Basketball from the Clip Joint on cmpradio.net. We're at the half. cmpradio.net. It's the station.
We're back here in the clip joint. Start the second half. Alden Reed leads 42-11. I want to give a shout out to Tiffany Richardson, who screenshotted me some names from Alden Reed's scorebook. So now at least I have some names to go with the numbers. Talking to the Alden Reed fan base. Alden Reed comes to this game with a record of six and four. Plays some tough opponents. Cardinal O'Hare, teams down south, Staten Island Academy. Number 10 shoots and she hits the three. That's Zay Norell for Alden Reed. And they stretch the lead 45 to 11. Chester brings the ball down. That was blocked. Come down number three is Maya Breaks Young. Young with the pass to number 32. Back to Young. Back to number one was Jordan. And Chester passes to both. And it'll be a turnover on the Lady Clippers. Ball back to Alden Reed. And again, Alden Reed with a record of six and four. Played some very tough competition. Chess Lady Clippers, this is their very first game of the year. As again, they've been caught under some of the COVID protocols and teams canceling games. Chess Lady Clippers sitting in the 2-3 zone. We stretch it over to number one, Jordan. That is number three. Number two is Ashley Wiggins. Back to number three. Mayor Brax Young, or says Maya, I'm sorry. Maya passes it to number 10. Back to 32 from Shayla Smith. And Smith is fouled. Two shot foul. That foul on number 35 for Lady Clippers. Sinaja Henley. That'll be her first, team's first of the first half. I mean, excuse me, second half. At the line, Shayla Smith for Alden Reed. And she makes the first. She's been to the line a lot today. Also, here's a couple threes. This is her second shot here. She makes them both. So, Tanaja Bost brings it up for the Lady Clippers. And she comes over in the middle. Looking, passes to Hall. Hall with the shot. Rebound, Smith. Off to Maya Young. She dribbles down the back. The lane shoots and miss misses. Rebound, Lady Clippers. Off to Hall. Hall dribbles down. And she sees daylight. She's going to the basket and she's fouled. That foul will be on all the reason number 32, Shayla Smith. So Shine Hall will go to the line. She'll shoot two. And she misses the first. And one thing I will say about these Lady Clippers, if they do get near the basket, they will shoot it. And that's what you want to see. It'll be a violation. Lady Clippers jumped in the lane early. So Maya Young brings the ball down. She's been the catalyst for this team, keeping the ball in her hands. And everybody they're looking for Smith in the box over to number one, Jordan. Jordan Breck to Maya Young. Oh, unforced error. And Lady Clippers number 20. Oop, stolen there. And there's a foul. And that foul will be on Tanaja Bose for Lady Clippers. And I think that's her third. The sub comes in for the Lady Clippers, number three. Shayana Snowden. So Maya Brax Young with the ball for Alden Reed. She passes on the corner. Out on the wing, back to Young. Three-point attempt by Norell. She misses. Rebound Hall for the Lady Clippers. And she brings up it now. She runs the point. Kelly. The shot misses. Rebound. Lady Clippers, she misses. Smith gets it. 
Ball and Reed. And a turnover. And we have the substitution for Alden Reed, number 30. Cheyenne. I don't have a last name for her. And she replaces Zay Norell. Let the Clippers take it out. Cheyenne Hall will now bring it up. The game is now in a running clock. As Alden Reed's up over more than 30, up 36 at this point. That's the number 35. At the Kelly, who's number 32. Look, she looks. She swings it to Snowden. Snowden drives to the basket. Oh, she misses. Nice hustle going to the basket. Ball will go over to Alden Reed. And again, Maya Brax Young brings the ball down for Alden Reed. Just puts a little pressure. My with the shot, misses. And she didn't hit nothing. A couple of bodies hit the floor, no call. And at this point, you might not get too many calls, especially with a 36 point lead. Unless it's very blatant, I don't think you'll get too many. So Shy Hall brings it up for the Lady Clippers. And they let me sit in a 1 4. Muhammad with the shot. Oh! And that was Snowden with the three. Right now, Alden Reed the ball with dribbling, one one, over to Smith in the corner. She misses. Rebound. Muhammad. And then she brings it up. Makes about the timeline. She's looking. She's looking. Dribbles, and she's fouled. That foul on Alden Reed's number 30, Cheyenne. Substitution coming in for the Alden Reed, number 12, Sakina. And for the Lady Clippers coming in, substitution number 10. To Leah Smith. Muhammad takes it out, and she passes it in the hall. Hall looking to run the offense. Two minutes and some change left. And a shot. And a three-point basket for the Lady Clippers. To Leah Smith. So she comes up the bench and hits a three. And Chester hitting two threes back to back. Oh, cross court, number 12. Nice pass, but oh, great defense by the Lady Clippers. Hall with the ball. Hall's looking. Oh, a little bit of everything in that one. Got a double dribble. So ball will go back to Alden Reed. Let's see who takes it out. Maya Brax Young will take it out. She gives it to number 12, which is Sakina. Sakina's now running up for the top of offense. Back to Young. Young with the shot, a three-point attempt. And she scores. I guess she felt that she was getting enough assists. She won the basket of her own. And now Hall would bring the ball up for the Lady Clippers. Let's see again if they look for Hall or for Muhammad. And Hall shoots it herself. Out of bounds. And Young brings the ball down here for Alden Reed as they come down. 35 seconds left in the quarter. Number 30 shoots. And she makes a three. That is Cheyenne. Again, I don't have a last name for her. At least I have her first. And let's see Chester with the hole for one shot. Rebound number 20, Muhammad. Oh, and she missed, but good rebound. And that foul on number 30, Cheyenne. So I don't know if that's her second or her third. It was the team's third. A 
Oh, excuse me. She has five because she fouled out. I get him on the other side of the court, so I don't have the foul total. But it was a team's third. Number 20, Jemiah Muhammad shoots two free throws for the Lady Clippers. And she makes the first. She prepares for the second. The rebound was Snowden. Snowden and Muhammad both fighting for that. Ball goes off both. Jemiah Muhammad's a freshman. And that's the end of the quarter here from the clip joint. We have one more to go. You're watching Girls Varsity Basketball from the clip joint on cmpradio.net. <laughs> We're back here at the clip joint, fourth quarter. Score is 53 to 18. Fourth quarter, ball would belong to the Chess Lady Clippers. And Jemiah Muhammad would take it out. And she would pass it to Shine Hall. Hall runs the offense. Number 10 shoots for the Clippers. Smith, oh, rebound. Again, number three, run the offense, Young. Still for the Lady Clippers, but he's back to Smith. Back to Young for Alden Reed. Alden Reed drives with Blaine. And there's a foul that would probably be on Jemiah Muhammad. So at the line would be number 55. Looks like Leah Strickland for Alden Reed. She has two shots. And she misses the first. Leah has one more. And she makes the second. And she gets a loud cheer. Shy Hall comes across the timeline running for Lady Clippers. She was off the number 10. Smith. Smith looking. She's on the wing. And she gives it to number 35, Henley. And Hall with the shot, and it's good. So all the Reed brings across the timeline. Young, passes to Smith. Smith on the wing, shoots, no good. Still with the rebound. She brings it down the left side. Shea's looking to Muhammad. And nice pass and assist there. Muhammad from Snowden. And again, I like to see that they're not quitting. And they're still competing. Young brings it down for Alden Reed. She's looking to run the offense. Up the top of King. He's a number five. I think they're trying to look there for Strickland. But number five shoots instead. Strickland with the rebound. And off Snowden. Strickland loses her scrunchie. And she puts it back in. Substitution for Chester coming in is Kanea York. She's a junior. She replaces number 35, Henley, who's also a junior. Young takes off for Alden Reed. She's looking. 
Up top, looking for number 20. Was London. Hall with the steal. Hall with the, oh, he misses the bunny. Young brother down, she comes on the right side, looking. He's a Euro step, she misses the layup. Muhammad with the rebound. Chester's pushing, comes to the right side. It's Smith, and Smith is fouled. That foul be number five, Anaya Howard. And a substitution in for Alden Reed, number 11. I think her last name is Jalia or Jalia. And the referees are discussing something. I missed that. Both subs back in for number 10, Talia Smith. And we have a turnover ball, goes back to Alden Reed. Five minutes left in the game. Number 11 will be taken out, Jalea. And she gives it to number 12, Sakina. Sakina now is running the, the point for Alden Reed. And number 20 was London. Steal there by Hall from Chester. She pulls up, shoots, she misses. Rebound, Muhammad from Chester. She shoots, and she scores. Fine game for number 20, Jemiah Muhammad. Again, a freshman. And again, like I like to say, the Chess Lady Clippers are not quitting. They're still fighting, even down 30. Pin a D, swing around to number 11. They got a double dribble there. As on Jalea or Jalaya. Hope I'm saying her name correctly. I apologize if I'm not. If I'm not saying her name correctly. Both now back in the game for Lady Clippers, and she's now running the point. President Snowden on the wing with the shot. She misses. Snowden follows up the shot. Goes back up, misses. And the ball stays with Chester. Muhammad will take it out. Goes over there by Snowden. Like I said, no quit. Good pass. Hall missed. But she'll go to the line. That personal foul number 55, Leah Strickland. Shine hard the line for Lady Clippers. She'll shoot two. And it's 325 remaining in the contest. She misses the first. And she misses the second. Rebound by Strickland. And a foul call. That'll be on Shine Hall for Chester. That'll be the team's fourth. Alden Reed's ball. And it'll be given to Sakina, who will run the point. As Maya Young is now out the game. And it's like now Alden Reed's just going to run some clock. And shot misses Muhammad. The pass he runs. Boast. Snowden. Snowden misses, but she's fouled, and she'll go to the line. That personal foul on all the reads, number 12, Sakina. So now Snowden will go to the line, and she'll shoot two. Shiana Snowden, a sophomore. She shoots the first, she misses. Let's see here if she makes the second. And we'll see if Alden Reed here will run some clock. She misses both, rebound for Chester. Back to Bose. 
Pulls, goes to the basket. Use the Euro. Oh, and she misses. But nice Euro step. And that personal foul number 55, Leah Strickland. That was a good rebound there by Kanea York, who passes it back out to Bose. Bose misses the first. So we have one shot here, 235 left in the contest. And she makes the second. And Chester calls a full timeout. 235 remaining. And again, the first game of the year for Lady Clippers. And again, you're watching this game on CMP Radio.net. Okay, 235 remaining in the contest. We are back here at the clip joint. Alden Reed's ball. Sakini will take it out for Alden Reed. Chester with a little token pressure. And they give the ball to number one, Jordan. And she brings it across the timeline. Chase being chased by Snowden. Let's see if Snowden got to force a count on her. If not, she'll just dribble the ball out, Jordan. Again, Alden Reed's running clock here. That's what they're they planning to do. And a little ticky tack foul. That'll be on Snowden. That'll be the team's fifth. And again, Jordan gets it, and she holds Snowden on her. It was like Jordan's going to just run the clock out. Chester has a foul to give before they shoot. Now Chester with some pressure. Here comes both. Jordan still dribbling the ball out. Chester hasn't got a five count. And there's a blocking foul. Blocking foul. On Janaja Bose. So that's the foul they had to get it with a six. Alderman takes it out, and a steal. Bose with the ball. Bose is going to the basket, and she's fouled. That foul will be on number 55, Leo Strickland. And Bose will shoot two for Chester. Set up for Chester number 10. Delia Smith. <laughs> it was like Bush was pulling the old string trick. And it worked. So they call a double violation, and they'll go with the jump ball, so ball goes to Alden Reed. Good defense there by Shine Hall. 
All the reading that will take the ball out on the side. 109 remaining in the contest. And again, Jordan with the ball. And she'll bring it finally across the timeline. It looks like she's trying to try to just drip out the clock. Back to Sakina, Sakina back to Jordan. And right now, there's no count. So the clock now is a little count. Screen there by Sakina. And Jordan now, just like I said, just dribbling the ball up. They pass it. Oh, and a steal. But the ball will go out of bounds to Alden Reed. Sakina will take the ball out. She looks for number five. And a player control foul, number five, Anaya Howard. And both will bring the ball up. 20 seconds left in the game. So since she, does, she drives to the basket and with the shot, no good. Gets her own rebound. Goes back up again. On rebound. Stolen. And it's like Anaya Howard for Alden Reed. No basket. And that's the ball game. Or is it going to be a foul call here? Well, that's the ball game here from the clip joint. Alden Reed will pull this one out 54 to 25. They will move to 7 and 4 on the season. Just laid the clip is their very first game. They were now 0 and 1. Again, good hustle and fight for them. They fought hard. Good games by Shine Hall. Also, Jamiah Muhammad had fair games for the Lady Clippers. Again, you watch this game on cmpradio.net. I'm James Peach Howard. I will be signing off here from the clip joint. Again, final score, 54-25, Alden Reed over Chester. You watch a cmp.net production. I'm out. Cultivating Mature Positivity. CMPRadio.net.